Resetting Face ID on your iPhone 15 is crucial as it enhances your device's security by allowing you to update your facial recognition data, especially if your appearance has significantly changed or if you want to prevent unauthorized access. This can also come in handy when dealing with problems using Face ID Unlock and other relevant authorizations on your iPhone. In this video, we'll explore how to reset the Face ID on your iPhone 15 series and troubleshoot common issues affecting the iOS facial recognition functions. To begin, swipe up from the bottom of the display to get to the home screen. From the home screen, select Settings. Once you're in the Settings menu, navigate downwards and select Face ID and Passcode. The next step requires you to input your screen passcode. After this, scroll down and select Reset Face ID. Resetting Face ID on your iPhone essentially wipes out the stored data of your face that it uses for recognition. After the reset, your iPhone will no longer be able to unlock using Face ID. This means that you'll need to enter your passcode to unlock the phone and use any features that rely on Face ID for security. If you wish to use Face ID for unlocking your phone, for wallet and Apple Pay, or for password autofill, you'll need to set up a new Face ID as new. This can be done by simply selecting the Set up Face ID button and then following the rest of the on-screen instructions to complete the facial recognition procedure. If a Face ID reset doesn't fix the problem, resetting all settings can be considered among the last options. Resetting all settings on an iPhone puts all the customized settings back to their factory defaults, but without erasing your data. It's a good option if you're experiencing strange behavior with your iPhone caused by messed up settings, but don't want to go through the hassle of a complete data wipe. To do so, head over to Settings and then tap on General. Tap on Transfer or Reset iPhone and then tap Reset. Select Reset all settings from the given options and follow the rest of the on-screen instructions to restore all default settings without erasing user data on your iPhone. And that covers everything in this video. If you found it helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more content like this. Thank you for watching.